Hey folks, Daniel with Z-Man here, and I want to tell you about a brand new bait that we've got that I'm really excited about fishing for trout, redfish, and flounder here right in our backyard in the low country of South Carolina, and that's the Trout Trick Jerk Shrimps, the newest addition to our Trout Trick family. It's got the same rib body. A lot of people think that those ribs on the body cause a vibration that really triggers fish to bite. Uh, regardless of why it works, all these Trout Trick baits are really effective and the new jerk shrimps is no exception. Now, if you've spent any time fishing salt water, you know that shrimp are a primary forage, not just for trout and redfish, but also for flounder, small tarpon, snook, a variety of game fish eat shrimp. And when a shrimp swims, it swims forward very slowly, but when a shrimp is frightened or being chased, they move backwards in sharp jerks. Now, most shrimp baits on the market, the vast majority of shrimp baits on the market, all are designed to move forward. This is one that's designed to move backwards. You can see here the profile of this bait. It's got a tucked under tail that looks like how the shrimp folds its tail back when it's darting away. It's got some swept back legs and it's got a couple of antennas that have little paddle tails that when you, when you hop it and twitch it or reel it fast, they really start to paddle back and forth. Now, since this is supposed to mimic a backward swimming shrimp, you rig this backwards. I wanted to share a couple of ways that I like to rig this bait and fish it. The first for uh, shallow water, flats fishing, sight fishing type applications is on the TT Lure Snake Locks jig head. This is an articulated jig head. Um, it's a weedless design. There's nothing to you know, hang up on grass or oyster shells here. It's great for hopping along the bottom um, and you don't have to worry about getting hung up. The other way I like to rig this is also backwards on just a standard uh, headlocks jig head, just a plain lead jig head with an exposed hook. It's a very strong jig head. It's capable of really muscling big redfish. Um, got a good wide gap to it. that has got a deep bite for sea trout, which have a, a really uh, weak skin on their lips. Um, so you get a nice solid hook set on the trout also. And the way that you fish this is to mimic a fleeing shrimp. You don't want to just drag it slow along the bottom because when a shrimp is moving slowly, it's doing so forward. You want to hop it with short, sharp jerks of your rod. Hop it and let it settle back down to the bottom. Hop it, really get those, those antennas going and let it settle back down to the bottom. That's the way we like to fish all the trout trick baits. In fact, one reason why we came up with this design is because a lot of people were telling us, we think the original trout trick works so well because it looks like a shrimp swimming backwards when you're popping that rod and jerking it backwards sharply. That's how that bait is most effectively fished. Well, we said, well, we can make an even better backward shrimp imitation, and this is it. We've been tweaking this design for a few years now. I can't tell you how many sea trout, redfish, and flounder we've caught right here in our backyard using this bait. So give it a shot, the new Trout Trick Jerk Shrimps from Z-Man.